Hello everybody, ReaperX1 here again, back playing some more of my adventure in my out and about little series for uh, version 0.7.6, the newest of the stable builds. There's already an unstable build, but I, well, I want to finish this one up. I like this one. It's going to become a creative save eventually. I figure I'm going to do that with this stable one because it's needed. My creative save that I had before, it doesn't work no more, so I need me a new one. So I welcome you to the progress of that save. <laughs> and I thank you for joining me also, you know. It's you coming and visiting me that makes it so much mu much more fun than I ever thought YouTube would have been. I don't know, I probably said it a bunch of times, but I didn't actually just start this channel just to share my ideas on the Terror Tech forums and, well, I like editing videos and playing games as always. So it works out pretty good. It's a nice hobby enjoyable. They get to meet new people. So, you know, if you want to throw a comment down below, you know, even if it is just to say hi, it'd be pretty cool. You know, I usually say hi back at least. Or something else. Have a good one usually, too. <laughs> so, yeah, hey, are you having a good one? I hope so. Mine's been pretty good today. It's been enjoyable. Oh, look at this guy. He's trying to wreck my good day. Take that, you bully. I'm not taking your crap. Oh, these little guys. What? What is this Geocore thing? Where'd they come out of? Not a Geocore cab on them. And yet, I was doing a Geocore uh, hunting mission. And I killed a Geocore, and it did not count. And it had a Geocore cab. I'm pretty sure it was the last video, you know, and we watched it blow up. It did not count. That counter did not go up from one. It did not go to two. Bum me out. Because some of those missions are a pain in the butt to get. Especially the venture ones. Jeez. Well, this can be a tricky one. I was really kind of hoping by now they would have had it set, so, like, if you pick a mission that is, like, a... A prioritized mission that maybe it would up the chances of getting said text so like venture mission venture venture hunting mission for Hawkeye you would have maybe 60% chance of getting a venture tech that spawns in in your area could could be behind you though or just out of sight but on the radar so it's up to the player still to investigate the mark on the radar even so you know I think that'd be nice it has been getting better but still it is a little off from where it would have been would be nice because I know I'm still I did this this playthrough a little different so well I tried this this idea again where I do pretty much all the GSO license all the way up until I get Hawkeye open and then I open up the other ones so I can do the corporation hunting missions as they come up. And then have those three licenses hopefully progress pretty much at the same time. But no, they have not. The venture one is, as usual, it's the slowest one to progress, I find. But, hey, that might be changing too, because in that newer update I was mentioning... That canary one that I did the video for there the other day, and actually it's into an unstable now, I believe. I haven't actually played it yet, but I'm going to get at that one eventually. And uh, it's got a new mission for the start of the venture license. It's a race now, or a time trial, I believe, instead of a battle. So they've been putting some work into it, so it's good stuff. It's a good sign. Maybe we'll have it all kind of balanced a little better so we'll, we won't have such a, a hard time finding those uh, venture techs. I think maybe we all maybe need to kick in a couple more venture techs, like pure venture techs, or really close to pure venture techs in the community cores. I think I'm going to try that. I'm going to try and make a note and remember to do that. I don't know if I have any pre-made, but I think I can come up with an idea or five. I ain't gonna make that many, but I bet I can come up with a bunch of ideas. <laughs> That's just my exaggerated way of saying it. 
Yeah, now I'm just getting stuck in the middles of my truck, so it was time to do that one. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't take care of that earlier, but I guess it didn't really come up. <laughs> like, dig up. He came up, stepped up, fell down, went to pieces. Poor little sucker. I give him, I give him it. Oh, he, he tried. He tried. No, okay. Make it. Take them trees out. There we be. Okay, now we're getting a crate. Mission complete. Right on. I kind of like that. I'll put that. Maybe I'll wait a minute. Let's get this one dealt with first. We'll get our blocks put away. Just in case that happens to be a battle one and then I gotta just fight and I don't want to blow up any of my good blocks that I got rewarded. Yeah, it is a fight too, dang it. Oh, okay, the blocks I left there, all my magnets aren't really that important. I got my fabricator put away, that was, ooh, you went down like a chump. I mean, champ. Yeah, champ. Chump, not really, it was there. <laughs> he was like one shot at him right in the face and he went out. Oh, I got my batteries down. That's not good. No good. Take him out. Yeah, no fun in games when the batteries go down. Uh -huh. Stop screwing around, you knock heads, and you take them out. That's what needs to happen there. Now, the only problem with that theory is sometimes they got more guns and more batteries and they take you out. So they go by the same strategy. Mm -hmm. Now, the trick is to fine tune it. However, that has to happen. I still haven't quite perfected any, anything near that. Still working on it though. Right. But that's the trick. They're sneaky little buggers sometimes. I don't know. I think they may get a little help. Because the game looks at where you are and what you got. And I think they're like, yep, if we send this formation down at him all at once, he's screwy. And then they got like an 80% chance of winning. Man, look at that. I got it stuck right in there. Or, or I wonder if it grew. I don't know if those ones grow back anymore. They used to, but I think they do. I'm not sure. I haven't really stuck around in a single area to check it out. And I don't use them much either. Ooh, racy. That guy, he'll find me when he wants me. I didn't go too far. If he he's that simple, he can't follow my treads. Or, oh, I guess yeah. That's me being awful. I want treads, but my tracks. He doesn't deserve to even come and talk at me. There. Put my little racer out. Yeah, get my bubble on. Oh, bubbly up. Alright. We try this, see how we do. Oh, it's a drag to me. Whee! Oh, beauty. We got it. We got it. I oh, didn't get much for it, though. I got a little machine gun in the wheel, though. So, hey. We got some experience. That's a good thing, because look, we're getting close to the next uh, grade on that license. So that's going to be cool. Put that away. Now we will get that off of there. We will put him away. Don't want to get those parts blown up. Mm -mm. Not after the fight and I had to do to set this up. Kept screwing up and using the damn parts on the big tech. So I'd have to get replacement parts. So I don't like taking stuff off the big tech when it really works nice. Look at that. It just skipped up that hill like it was nothing. Got a drop on that guy. I'm gonna take his fans if they actually survive. Oh, we might get one. Two? Oh, I thought I saw. Oh, yeah, maybe two. That looked like two. Nice. When I first saw him, I actually thought he had megatons on. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa you're mine, buddy. But then, no, uh, they were fans. But those are alright, too. Because I, I have ideas for other, other builds in this uh, playthrough. But I got a feeling this is gonna blow up again. Like, it's not the first time I've lost my truck. It won't be the last time, I think. It's because I don't really like to wait. 
So if it's nighttime, my batteries are low, and there's a battle nearby, and I have even the slightest thought that I could win, I'll try it. But then I get blown up. <laughs> so you know, I don't. Doesn't matter to me. It's fun. Even if they knock me back to a puny little guy, you know, I can scrap my way through stuff. Use the default text I get for free and <laughs> just fight for a billion times and take him out. I'm, I'm kind of determined like that, even to the point of stubbornness. Yeah, bullheaded. <laughs> so we got back to Mikey here. Hey, what's up, Mike? How's it going, buddy? What are you up to? Ah, oh, you got jumped, eh? Friggin' punts. Oh, yeah. Took the dang booster off you, too. Oh, that's rough, dude. Ah. Should mess with Mike, eh? Should make him one of those big boosters. Sneak it on him and go bang! And then watch him fly in circles like a frickin' pinwheel. That'd be awesome. I'd love if you could mess with the game like that. <laughs> Just add the wrong part to him and be like, what? And it'd react in whatever way. That'd be cool. Be good for a surprise joke, especially if no one knew it could have. I wonder. You think the, the developers are funny like that? And you got a sense of humor and thought of stuff like that? They haven't. I tried. <laughs> At least the last time I tried, anyway. I always try to mess with Mike. Sometimes you get the bugs in the game where you can mess with stuff you're not supposed to mess with. Like the trading station, it actually fell apart at one point. Like long, 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 long time ago. That was kind of cool. You can get terminals out of it. <laughs> yeah, Crafty Mike's had issues before. I can't. I don't know if you could ever take them apart, though. I think you could damage them. Or something like that. I don't know. I might be thinking of something else. I just get forgetful. But yeah, I only need a couple resources and I've done this a few times. So I figure I've got it almost memorized that if I use the mortar and uh crap I forgot the oh, my memory sucks. I think it was that radar that you'll get what you need for that mission there. The craftier business three. Yeah, there we are. We got him his thruster. Had to be the right one, though. Wouldn't let me even pick the other one. He wasn't screwing around. He's like, yeah, no pranks. I ain't looking at you, so you're not pranking me. What you giving us? Take this with us. He's giving us that, so that's pretty sweet, eh? He's a hell of a good guy. Just swing on one of them. Ooh, looks like AI cab. Nice. So yeah, I'm back to a battle again. They could end me. Because the Geocore Ooh, what? Oh nice. I like that. Didn't quite see what it was for, but alright, I can deal with it. It'll be alright. <laughs> So yeah, these Geocore ones, they can send some big baddies at you, and next thing you know, you have your decent, uh, or more than decent sized tech, just run down like nothing. Oh, you take one out or two out, but still, they get you. It sucks. But you know, these ones, they look a little more suitable for this guy. My tech is decent size, but he doesn't have super powerful crazy weapons on him. It's only got a couple megatons, a little bit of Hawkeye, and yeah, I don't even have any missiles on them. Yeah, that's rough. No missiles. Ouch. I might have to do some of that craft and stuff for them. I have been getting uh, the idea that maybe it'll just be good to like, do the Hawkeye missions. But I don't know if you really get Hawkeye encounters too much outside of like the missions from the mission board, like just as a random. I don't know if I've gotten any of those in this playthrough. Not that I can think of. It's usually like the main three and then... Yeah, I don't think I really have had just a random one. There has been ones I've gotten from uh, the shop. Which I don't know, is it really 
Yeah, I guess there still is some random ones, I guess. So they seem random. Oh, look at this guy. Moving in on my crate. Thinks he's taking it over. Uh-uh. Rolling fortress. You're rolling no more. I'm gonna put a big hole right in your backside. Hope you don't mind too much, but it's gonna suck for you. It's gonna sting like a mm-hmm. Hey, right on. We get the kill there. We get a crate here. Ooh, that's a good one too. I like the rail guns, I really do. And then those AI sentry turrets, those are pretty damn sweet. Can't complain about them either. You put them on attack and they're pretty damn effective. <laughs> See what we get. Ah, we're gonna get attacked. Jumping us. But I think as I destroy these little weaklings, I'm gonna pull this one at an end. So as always, you know, I'd like to thank you again for joining me. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. And if you did, you know, throw the like down below, the comments, subscription, dinging of the bell, all that good stuff that only you guys can bring to a channel. That's what fuels my little channel. You know, it is muchly appreciated. That's why I always thanks you, and I do always mean it. I hope you do know that. And as for, uh, if you, and another way of maybe showing some, uh, support or whatever, you know, there's that certain showcase. Just find the link down below. I was talking about that at the start, I believe. Huh? So until next time, everybody, keep being the awesome, keep having a good one. Bye.